I'm gonna go. All right, we are going to read a dog's life book, and it is Sensing Your Dog by Michael J. Rosson. Sensing like. Sensing like your dog. Your dog. Izzy can read better than I can today. It's a dog's life. Isn't that cute? How they made that G a doggy. It's a dog sin doggy. Sensing like your dog. And this is the table of contents. Now we're into it. If your dog could read, could you not chew your nails, please? You will have to read these six books for your dog as well as yourself. You will be both student and teacher. A dog is a fine student. If you are a fine teacher, your dog will supply his talent to learn. He will work for praise, play, and treats because they create safety, happiness, and comfort. In this book, you will learn how a dog sees the world through his sense. The more you can understand a dog's way of sensing the world, the more you will be able to value his special nature. This will strengthen the remarkable partnership you share. Stop nibbling. I love you, but stop it. The dog's view. From a dog's point of view. Look what this dog is. Beautiful dog. This looks like our friend's dog. From a dog's point of view, seeing is less important than smelling or hearing. Dogs do recognize faces, but what they mostly look for is motion. As hunters, dogs watch for movement in the distance. They focus on a quick motion. Dogs can see color, but their eyes are really made to see shades of white and black in dim light. Dog's eyes can pick up small amounts of light. This allows them to see even in darkness. The nose knows. Dogs are the best centers on land. Some kinds of dogs have better noses than others, but any dog's sense of smell is a million times better than humans. Our noses have five million cells for smelling. Dash, Dax, huh, Huns. Dachshunds. I thought I always thought it was dash hounds. I don't know how to say it. Dachshunds. Have 125 million cells. Mom, are you talking about dachshunds? Fox. Duck. Dachshunds. Dachshunds. I don't know. Dachshunds. Dachshunds. Stop. Dachshunds. Oh, uh, where were we at? 125 million cells. Fox terriers have 150 million. German shepherds have more than 200 million. Wowzers! A bloodhound has 300 million scent cells. Beautiful doggies. When you enter a room or walk out a door, your eyes scan everything, right? That is what a dog's nose does when it encounters a new setting. Dogs spend a lot of time sniffing one another. They leave urine marks to show other dogs the borders of their territories. Please don't pee on stuff to bar mark your territory. That's disgusting. <laughs> What's that I hear? A dog's ears pick up sounds that are too high, too low, and too far away for humans to hear. Their outer ears are called pin... Pinne. 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 Eighteen muscles direct these sound-receiving dishes. Dogs with tall ears such as Siberian Huskies or Great Danes have the best hearing. Dogs with droopy ears, such as bloodhounds, depend less on hearing. A resting dog can completely ignore many sounds, yet he will jump up at the instant an important sound occurs. The mouth of a hunter. A dog's tongue is not as specialized is not as specialized as a human's, but it acts like a drinking cup, bringing water to the mouth. Curling downward, the tongue dips into the water, traps a sip under the tip, then slides it inside to deliver the drops. A dog's mouth is made for seizing, tearing, and gulping. In front, small incisors nibble meat. The canines wound or hold the prey. Molars work like scissors, cutting meat into pieces or crushing bones. Spend a day, hey, stop. Spend a dog day. Cut it out.
don't. I want to read you this book. Spend a, try this, spend a dog day. Imagine what the world just must be like through your dog's sense. Think about that. When you see your dog sniffing, oh, you smell pretty good. Try to guess what he's detecting. What do you smell? I smell cleanness. Another time, try the same experiment look, with I listening. Oh, this time we gotta listen. Watch your dog's ears. See when they perk to, to attention or shift towards sounds. What do you hear? Finally, I can't see through you. <laughs> Finally, try seeing your home and yard from your, a dog's eye view. Put your head at your dog's level. How does that change what you can see? All right, Izzy, that was the last page. The end, sensing your, like your dog.